Hey drivers, little uh, safety share about regen. When the truck needs a regen, it will tell us that it needs a regen. And here's the thing, the countdown on the regen doesn't start until you shut the truck off and turn it back on. So if you get notified that the truck needs a regen while you're driving, continue driving and you will be able to get to your destination. Once you shut it off, the countdown starts. At that point, you have to push the button on the dash, hold it down for a couple of seconds until you hear the RPMs go up. You can let it go. It'll run for approximately an hour, but be careful where you park because underneath the truck is going to get to about a thousand degrees. You can burn grass, any kind of debris. You can even start to melt the asphalt if you're on asphalt. So be careful where you park. Okay, regen number two. That first tractor we uh, showed you was a 276 Mac. This is a 278 Mac. The regen is on stock. Now, as we talked about the other tractor, this is the same as the other tractor. You can drive it until you get to your destination without regening. But once you stop and shut the motor off, the countdown begins. So at that point, you go to the stock, go to the main menu, scroll down to the bottom. Here, you go on maintenance, click the middle button on the stock to activate maintenance, and then down two more spots to request park gen. At that point, you'll hear the RPMs go up in a couple of seconds after that. It'll run for an hour. It'll be hot underneath, so watch where you park again. And when it's done, the RPMs will come back down and you're ready to go.